Rapper, actor, and entrepreneur. We were first introduced to the mini heartthrob in the early 2000s as Lil Romeo. My new show is called The Romeo Show. Y'all can catch it every Saturday at 8.30. And um, it's kind of like a modern day Partridge type family thing mixed with like Fresh Prince of Bel Air. So it's real positive and um, it's going to be a lot of fun. Make sure y'all check it out. Tell us about your character. Well, my character, his name is Romeo. And um, he's trying to get to where I'm at right now. He's trying to get all the jewelry, be number one on the billboard and everything. So like my character, he's driven to be number one. And he's trying to be where I'm at right now. He's come a long way from his first platinum single, My Baby, in 2001, starring in his own Nickelodeon show in 2002, to movies, college, fashion, basketball, even owning his own record label, No Limit Forever Records, and so much more. I'm top 20 in basketball right now. I'm top 20 in the nation. I've been doing that. And uh, my dad called me Super Baby because I do so many things. So I do acting, rapping, basketball. I might go to the moon next time, so you never know. I just want to thank all the fans out there. He has proven over the years that there is no limit to his success. Magazine this way, please. Romeo! Let's take a look at the evolution of Romeo Miller. And I just came from rehearsal. I had a seven hour rehearsal. I'm doing Dancing with the Stars. So I just came from there. But I'm here, you know, I'm trying to be Superman. I'm trying to be in two places at once. I'm here just to give back. President of No Limit Forever now, so I got the record label. We look, I'm looking for hungry artists out there like my pops back in the day. I want people who've been through the struggle want to make a difference. So. You know, I have to ask you about your own personal struggle. We have so many industry babies, I'm going to call it. You guys are coming up now. You guys are taking over the scene of what your parents were doing. But was it hard trying to find your own identity and not just being known as Master P's son? I mean, for me, uh, I f everybody's human. At the end of the day, we all have our own obstacles to go through. And for me, it's just life, you know? I don't really find it hard. I don't really think about it. For me, it's a pleasure to be able to live with somebody like my pops, Master P. This man, a mogul, a living legend. And I just, I just take off what he teach me. We're always trying to improve in some shape or form. I think that's what people don't realize. With life, um, if you want to truly be successful, I don't care how much success you, you gain or already have, there's always somebody coming behind you. So even the philosophy that my dad had is that you gotta put in work. Rule number one, no matter if there's an audience or not, you gotta stay fresh, baby. Smell good. Stay ready. So you don't gotta get ready. Showtime. I'm dressed up for the living room. I got a big movie in the works. I can't really talk too much about it. Two big movies, actually. I'm gonna say it's Superhero and Fast, Fast, Fast. And then uh, my new album coming out, I Am No Limit. My mixtape, Only God Could Judge Me. My new single with Sean Kingston called Famous Girl. My other new single, Rockin' With It, featuring four of my new artists. Uh, I'm gonna do a lot of charity work. I'm gonna have a big announcement, actually, on my Twitter. So y'all go to add my Twitter, at Romeo Miller. Go follow me. And uh, yeah, just gonna keep it going. I'm trying to save the world. <laughs> 